I'm somewhere here in Northwest Washington DC. So we got a call regarding the mouse problem. They were hearing some noises in the couch. So first they knew there was a mouse problem and then they got a company in here to bait and they used traps to cut a few mice, didn't catch any mice, sealed up some entry points, but there were still some entry points in the house, right? We got to the couch. So as soon as we flipped the couch over, this is the first thing we saw. So that is the baby mouse carcass that expired. And here is another one. So the thing is, so why did they continue to have a mouse problem? Why did they decide to nest in the couch? Basically came under the couch, through the bottom of the couch, and then went here. Let's see if we can get a good shot here. Somewhere inside the couch, made a nesting material with this thing here, and then it formed and started nesting in there. This is what we call a French door, right? So this thing slides out, back and forth, it slides. The mouse runs because the openings in this French door, in this French door actually opens into the wall. Until this gap is eliminated, this mouse problem is not gonna be solved permanently. So what I suggest is a customer to actually get a wooden cap, right? Push this French door all the way to the back, put a cap, right over it. Entry point to the right of this outlet. So there's an outlet here. There's a little gap right there where the cords are running. There was a hole made around the uh, shoe molding. That was completely missed. The running problem is always details. You always so this is our experience today and I hope this video helps.